What's up guys, it's Joe with Retro Plastic Gaming, and uh, I'm here with Scoop and Chris. We just got to Franklin Sons Collectible Show for the uh, Retro Gaming Expo. Let's go check it out.
Yeah, Joe. I saw they had a bunch of controllers and stuff, so I thought they might have the uh, Pokemon Stadium adapter, but I'm still not seeing it. I'm looking for a Super Game Boy and a Pokemon Stadium adapter. I haven't seen either one yet. Keep on.
And best thing, we also provide you a 30-day warranty. Awesome. What's up, man? Hey, how you doing? Doing great. How are you, how's your Saturday morning so far? So far, it's so, so good. It's hot, but it's not too bad. It's not too bad. You meet a lot of cool people that are into the same stuff, so. Right? How's your Saturday? Our Saturday is doing great. We're just doing. We're just down here doing some filming for our channel, uh, Retro Plastic Gaming. Okay, cool. You guys have an Instagram and everything. Uh, we don't have Instagram. We just have uh, Facebook and uh, YouTube. Okay, cool. I'll check you guys out. Thanks, man. Retro Plastic Gaming. All right, right here is our favorite favorite seller, Lewis. What's up? What's up, man? How's it going? Good, good. You guys just getting here? Yeah, we just got here. A lot of people in here, man. Yeah. You gonna go to the after party at the Pixel Bowl? It really depends. Yeah. Depends on how tired I am at the end of the day. I'll be honest. It's like 50 50 so far. These guys all got up here for 200. Dude, this guy's got some pretty swag shit right here. I bought Chrono Trigger in the box at this expo last year for 200 and I've seen it at three different booths this year in the same condition for four. Really? Yeah, I'm like, what the hell? Uh, well, I can't say it, it doesn't have the maps. Yeah, it's not like yeah. all the way complete. Yeah, That's but, how mine was. Yeah, too. but it has the manual and the actual card is actually really clean. Yeah, yeah, four, that's a, that's a good scheme. shit going on in this booth. Yeah, that's a great game. Uh, Always remember what you got in your collection. Yeah. Alright, so now if I could get another copy of Siphon Filter 1 and 3, I'd have my whole collection back. I used to have them. I don't know if they're in storage or if they got sold or stolen, what happened. Got about half the games I used to have. Right here, he's been kind of been hiding behind the camera, but it's one of our newest members for uh, Retro Plastic Gaming, Anthony. Yo, what's going on, people? Here, he's already picked up some of his shit. Yeah, and I'm still not done. <laughs> nah, some of the... Hasn't even been... It's been just over two hours and I'm already blew through a pretty good wad. Yeah. You, you, get, you pick up anything? Yeah, I picked up Demon's Crest. Oh, that was the only thing you picked up? Yeah, I'm only gonna, I'm looking for uh, um, uh, the transfer pack for Nintendo 64. Mm, okay. We've uh, apparently lost one person of our party somewhere, but it's not a very big convention, so we'll be able to find him soon. Yeah, you'll find one. Yeah. Alright everybody, check this out. Old school okay. shit right there. Oh shit, check it out. Yep. Right there. All three of these. Start oh, from the base set. One of them might even be shadowless, I can't really tell. Oh, this one. Yeah. You know an easy way? The it hollow looks the year different 1999. too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Little Valor pen's pretty cool. Oh Straight shit! Fucking for Pokemon Go. Yeah. I put one of those on my hat. Right? Awesome amount of pins. How much are the uh, Pokemon Go pens? Oh, pins are ten bucks today. Ten Usually bucks. They're fifteen. Yeah. Might have to pull some money out. Pull one of those on the I'll take hat. cards, by the way. Oh, you do take cards yeah. too. Alright, what would you pick up? So for about 20 bucks, $18, we got the whole set of culture run on PS1. Alright, and on PS2. Awesome. I'll have to do a little collection video for the channel where I play all of these games.